Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party, Season 3. So, if you look at my little status bar up there, on the tab screen, I died. It was kind of embarrassing, and I wasn't filming. Uh, it was, I was, wasn't out adventuring, wasn't doing anything risky. I was tending the bees, and a zombie wandered out of the thing because it was getting late at night. And uh, what do you know? Zombie comes, I smack him with my sword, kills him. And then he called for some backup. He called for reinforcements, which is kind of, uh, uh, you know, it's kind of annoying, but whatever. They're just zombies. Well, there was a little baby zombie. You know how they get their, they, they move erratically. They're kind of difficult to deal with. So I smacked him with my sword and I have fire aspect on my sword, which I'm thinking now maybe I should make another sword without that because he caught on fire and then he got stunned and he's kicked back for a little bit and then he ran at me and caught me on fire so i scrolled over to my water bucket and tried to put it down to put me out because i realized i was getting low on health and uh by the time oh by the time i uh, Tried to right click on it. I kind of scrolled away and I was placing torches and I died. So it was embarrassing. I kind of killed myself. Okay. Um, but fortunately, I was right outside my door. I mean, it was literally outside the front door of my house. So no big deal. Hey guys, what are you doing? You are unemployed villagers and you're stuck down there. We should, I should help you out. Okay, let me, let me work on that. I'm going to at least light things up so they don't get eaten. They'll get eaten anyway, I guess, but we should uh, protect these guys. Uh, but I came over here because I wanted to show you what Barb was working on. Barb makes things has been protecting this village. And... Um, so let me, let me find what she's been doing with the librarians and we will uh, let me find them and we'll come back and I will show you that. Hello, you're, you're in my way. So this is the, uh, I, I don't know, maybe we call this the library. I don't know. Uh, she's been developing some of the villagers and so she's got a couple decent, uh, villagers with decent chance. Infinity for seven. That's pretty good. Um, and, yeah, and this guy has um, what do he have? Oh, Fortune three. That's that's good. And is this the new one? Silk Touch for seven. So this is pretty awesome. So now I've got access to a Silk Touch book uh, on demand. Uh, so that, that's all right. And then there's other, the other guys here, but those are the ones that she thought were worthwhile and, um, and, uh, trapped. Sun still, wait, which, which way is that going? Uh, it's going down. Uh, so the way she gets emeralds is she's got a, ah, turn around tree farm, giant spruce trees. And then she goes in over here to these guys. She's got a bunch of Fletchers living in this house. Of course, no one's home right now, but yeah, no one's home right now. But she's got a bunch of Fletchers in here and she does sick trades. Hi. Um, so that's pretty cool. And then this is a little, this is where she's been living and she's got some stuff here. One of the toolsmiths has a, iron, has a diamond hoe. <laughs> So she traded some to get those just to level them up. Um, but she's got some Silk Touch axes here. Or had some. Yeah, Silk Touch axes. So one of the one of the toolsmiths has that. 
Um, so that's uh, that's that's not bad. So I I have one of those. She gave me one. Uh, so that's pretty cool. So I can't wait to see how this develops. Still no mending. Um, and yeah. So there's still a couple couple guys that she could stand to have. Uh, it'll happen uh, eventually. And um, when I set up my, my base, my actual full-time base, I'll probably steal a couple, not villagers from here, but I'll probably steal some villagers and start working on leveling them up. So sun's starting to go down. We get back to the base and then we'll move on to the next task for the day. Hi. How are you? That was no fair. It's a little hard to see from here, but I built some villager containment units and uh, hopefully that keeps them from getting eaten. They are unemployed villagers and I think given what I, the work I just put into getting them safe, hopefully bar mix things doesn't mind me uh, taking them and maybe storing them somewhere else safely for the time being. Come on. So there we go. Okay, so let's grab a few things here. Let's grab my nether helmet. And so I had gotten some... I still want to do that. I had gotten some uh, ender pearls from the pigmen in the ender, from the piglins. Sorry, they changed the name. Um, do I need her? That's all I need. And I, that was fun. It's like, oh, great. I, I don't mind having ender pearls. So that was all cool. Um, but then I, this stupid scroll when trying to right click thing when I get uh, stressed out, kind of struck and I accidentally threw all the ender pearls. So I don't have any more. And then I realized, this is not, uh, it's not ideal. So, non-zombified piglins, where are you guys? I know there's some here. There, there used to be. There should be some. Let's see here. Uh, just the zombie variety. But I had some over here, so... Oh, hello. Hello, sir. Can I interest you in some gold? Put out some fires. 
Can I interest you in some gold? Can you come over here? Let's. I don't like. Don't want to trade near all these fires. Come on, come on over here. Yeah. This is this is a good spot over here. There's plenty of light. No, no, this way. This way. Yeah, come on. Let's go. What are you doing? Okay, if I put it down here, let me put out these fires. I don't want you throwing stuff out and getting it. And let me put it let me put a torch or two here. So that I can see what's going on. And then would you like some gold? Yeah. Yes, you would. I thought so. Okay, give me some ender pearls, please. A couple would be nice. Okay, obsidian. Okay, the crying obsidian is okay. Okay, this is going to take a little bit. Let's see how much we get. Dude. Oh, look. Hello. Look what I'm holding. You want in on the action? Good. Oh, there's some uh, gold ore there. Oh, what's that? A book. Soul speed book. Oh, awesome. That would be very helpful. I don't need soul sand or that. Whoops. Oh, sorry. I took your gold away from you. There you go. A leather. Why do these guys have a leather? Oh, I've got almost a stack of spectrals. But no ender pearls. Come on, dude. Don't make me go. Oh, you took my... You, you gave me some boots and then you took them and put them on your own feet. That was pretty rude. Leather. Is that it? Did we get through the whole stack and I didn't get one single ender pearl? Okay then. Where, where's the ghast? Go around this way anyway. Okay, I'm gonna go get some more gold. There's all this gold here, and I can't mine it. Whoa! Hey! All right, so that was a pretty good um, bit of. Piglin trading? I've got a bunch of stuff here that I didn't have before, but no ender pearls. It's kind of annoying. And I don't have that much gold, so I did get a Soul Speed 2 book. That's going to be very helpful when I do more nether exploration, which I need to do. Because uh, oh, the nether rack was uh, courtesy of a ghast, not, not the piglins. Okay, so I'm going to do another round here and see what we get. Um, <clears throat> and hopefully we, we get what we want back into the nether. And hopefully these guys are still over here. Oh, and also fire resist potion, which is awesome. Guys still over here? Is the trading exchange still on? Oh, yeah. Look. Hi. How are you? Oh, you're not going to despawn because you picked up the boots that you uh, offered me. There we go. Let me put down some light here. I should trap you in here. Oh, you threw your stuff down there. That wasn't very nice. Um, there we go. Um, 
Can I, can I push you? Can I throw this to you down here? It's down there, down below. Ah. There you go. Welcome to your new home. Okay. Another Soul Speed book. Could be helpful. Let's get training again. Water bottle, good. So I can, when I do get some nether ward, I can start brewing. Now I have three bottles. <sighs> oh! There it is. Four ender pearls. Thank you, dude. Thank you so much. Everything else. Oh, some iron nuggets. Not bad. Okay. So we'll let him finish up his little trading session here. And we'll leave him here. Should be fine. And I don't think he's going to despawn because he put on the boots that he tried to give me uh, for some gold. So this is our little impromptu pickling trading area. And if I can get another guy in here, that would be awesome. So we'll just go all that faster. This is a pretty impromptu pickling trading, but it'll work. Okay, successful trip into the nether. Let's go home. Okay, look at this. We've got multiple Soul Speed 2 books. We've got we've got all kinds of stuff here. Um, I'll sort this all out and we will get it put away. But the important thing is I got Ender Pearls. So let me get things sorted out and then we will do something with the Ender Pearls. Okay, so they're just giving out obsidian in the nether. And of course, it's pretty plentiful. And yeah, I've got stuff here. So one thing that I, yesterday, I, I, did a, I did a live stream and went back into the nether to go back to that fortress to try and get a... Uh, try and get a some nether wart because I need it for the potion brewing. And that fortress has zero nether wart in it. There's no chests. There's no. Um, there's no nether wart room. There's no nothing. Okay. Ha! <sighs> this is a big deal. Where's my sword? Oh, sword goes there. Let's put the... No, no, no. Sword goes there. Let's put the nether chest, the ender chest here. So, I realized that my inventory fills up so quickly uh, because there's only so many spots and I don't have shulker boxes yet. Oh, it's raining or it's storming snowing oh 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 i've got some uh i've got some powdered snow there let me close the door and do i have any empty buckets not at the moment so let's uh let's make some up and then make give me give me a few buckets please there we go There we go. Two more powdered snow. Mm. Not that I have any need for powdered snow just yet, but I have a feeling it might come in useful for a kind of a fun, 
Oh, I had I had some buckets here. Okay, remember that next time. So I have six patterned snow buckets. Could be fun. Cool. So now I have ender chests and a silk touch pick. What more do you need? So I'm going to put an ender chest here and open it up. Ooh. Now I can put stuff in here. So this stuff like this, my emergency or backup gear, um, I can keep in the ender chest instead of in a, in a chest here so that if I'm out and about somewhere and I need one of these, I can grab it. And then I can uh, also put excess stuff, like if I recover some diamonds or some whatnot. So, you know what? Let's get some more obsidian. Let's make one more so that I can keep two in my possession. And... You know, I don't, I don't need the Ender Pearl to throw. So let's make two more Eyes of Ender. And make one more Ender Chest. Just in case I accidentally break one. So that can live here. My Shears can live in the other. And the Eye of Ender can go inside the Ender Chest. And then a little emergency stuff like like stuff if I go into the nether and like forget like hey golden helmet and uh, some obsidian and a flint and steel just emergency stuff in case I get into the nether and did not remember to bring essential items there we go and then we can also grab um, well certainly the fortune pick. Like some of these I really only really need at home. Um, another silk touch pick would be good. And I happen to have one in here. Right? Silky too. My backup silk touch pick. I can put inside the ender chest so that I, I know I can break it even if I lose everything. Um, yeah, and I'll, I'll load this up with some other useful stuff, some wood and some charcoal and some cobble and just miscellaneous stuff, but there we go. That is a productive, uh, expedition into the nether. I now have ender chests. Very important. Ah, uh, um, there we go. The question is, should the spare ender chest go inside my ender chest or inside my pocket? I can't remember how I did it before. I think I had a stack of ender chests in the ender chest. Yeah, I think, I think that makes more sense. So there we go. Let's sleep the night away. Go outside and take a look. And... Nice and sunny. That's the problem with sleeping is you then don't get the snow. Oh, goodness. This tree grew like a Christmas tree, and it's just not that time of year. All right. Well, I think that will do it. Um, probably will end up being a longer video than I, I planned, but we got a couple things done, and it was very productive. So thank you for watching. This is Theron. It's been Minecraft Land Party, and I will see you next time. Right, bye. <laughs>